Ano? Ano ng ano? Umayos ka ng sagot mo ha. Halika, dalian mo. Ano Happy ka umuwi ang ate mo. Huwag ka nang sumagot ito. Ilagay mo sa lamesa. Tulungan mo ang tatay mo. Ako na! Ha? Pero... Sabi ni Nay... Ah! Why sure walk? Such a beautiful day para sa ating anak na maganda. It was amazing. I sat at this park after yoga and I just couldn't stop reading my Bible. Did you know that Jesus fed 5,000 people with nothing but fish and bread? Wow. Look at her. You're like a saint. <laughs> what can I say? I just love Jesus. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Whitman. Yes, sir, I... Oh, that's wonderful, sir. Yes. In that case, I will see you tonight. Okay, sir. Take care. Pumayo yung amo ko, guys. My boss will be here for dinner tonight. See, Mr. Whitman? Whitman. <laughs> My goodness, Anna. Your father is finally going to get his promotion. Oh, congrats, Dad. Baby girl, Anna. Can you help Daddy? Because Mr. Whitman is Canadian and I haven't hosted. I can help. Don't worry. I'll take care of it. I can help. No need, Joseph. Alam na lang ate mo yan. Dad. Oh, sige, sige. Pag-usapan natin mamaya, mabuti pa, magkasal muna tayo. Okay? In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Bless us our Lord for these thy gifts which we are about to receive from thy bounty through Christ our Lord. Amen. Nakakalimutan kong bumili ng panghimagas. Ay, ang usyong-asyong na talaga. No problem, Nay. Ano to? Uwi eh. Alam kong uwi yan. Pero hindi magugustuhan ni Mr. Whiteman. Whiteman? Hmm. Ano namang problema nun? Eh, lila yan eh. Ang mga puti, hindi kumakain ng purple. Sorry for the scare. I made some of my famous dairy-free, gluten-free, non-GMO, vegan, keto, paleo, chocolate brownies. <laughs> you know, just in case. <laughs> Ay, nako! Paano ko pagandain ang bahay ko para mamukha naman matino? Ang pangit-pangit. Parang sabsaba ng baboy. Anong gagawin ko? Baby Jesus, please help me! Tay, utang gulat ko naman sa'yo! Ako na lang bahala dito. Bahala sa ano? Dito sa sala. Ay, ako na lang mag-decorate. Ano alam mo naman dyan, Joseph? Mag-tiwala ka na lang sa akin. Tara na. Maganda ka na. Sigurado ka, Joseph, ha? Yes, Tad. Sigurado ka, Joseph, ha? Ako na lang. Basta mag-relax ka na lang, okay? Bahala ko po mo. Ano ginawa ko sa bahay ko? Parang basurahan! Di ba? Akala ko gusto ko... ka pang sungka! So, e, parang pa ng... Mala sa buhay yan, Joseph! Ano mala sa buhay yan! Ay, ano, ano ba ito? May kita mo yan? Yung ungas niyan? Ikaw yan, si Judas! Joseph, dapat ikaw ang pinapako sa krus. Ungas ko talaga ang bata ka! Sarap mong sakalin! So, uh... Anong problema? Tay! Ang problema si Joseph, ha? Oh. 
Hindi ka nag-iisip. Bakit? Kasi utak biskuit ka. Huh? Si Mr. Whitman, taga oh. Manitoba. Oh, ano problema Hindi no? taga Manila. Hindi niya magugustuhan niyan kasi ginawa mong parang bagyo piyesta ang bahay ko. Dad, mm. I got something to show you. What's up, baby girl? Baka maalay mo, makita niya ay... Oh my lord. Iba ang humusay ni Ahate. Wow. Ang kain talaga ng anak ko. Yo, where did you get all this stuff? Baby girl, you saved us. Mr. Whitman would like this. He will promote me. He will add to my salary. And then daddy will add to your allowance. Oh. Ayan naman talaga. Mm. Yeah, but how did it I'd all... I'd love to stick around and chat, but I don't want to be late for Bible studies. I'll see you guys later. Bye. Ah, love I, you. Okay, now God bless. Ay, naku, pati pala sa puti, usong Pilipino time. Ha? Han. Oh. Mali daw ng kote si Mr. Whitman. Ay, ganun ba? Ay, asan si Marie? Ay, ganun yun, nag-aayos. Joseph? Hmm? Tingnan mo kay ate mo. Okay to ah. Uy, pwet na manok. Bakit yan? Hello? Is this Marie's brother? Yeah? Something happened to Marie. Can somebody come pick her up? Oh, I'm si Marie. Ah, uh, ah, uh, opo, pero, um, masamang pagiramdam niya. Nag, uh, nag lbm Ibibili ko ng gamot. Tatay si Marie? Ako, ako, ako na lang bahala. Joseph! Ayan, ayan, ayan. Ay. Showtime. <coughs> ha? Ah, o, oh, sige, sige. Ikaw na bahala. Ah, dumakas. Ako na. Good evening, Mr. Whitman. <laughs> come in, sir. Come in. Please don't tell mom and dad. Why did you lie? All my friends were going. I didn't want them to yeah, think I wasn't. Who cares what they think? They are my friends. Your friends back home would never let you. Well, get they're that not job. here, are they? Tell me, who do I have here? How about mama and papa? Are they not enough? Because they've always been on your side. How about me? Am I not enough? Growing up, Mom and Dad told me that it's always been their dream to move here. But every time they visited Canada, people would make fun of them for their accent or not knowing English. For eating with a fork and spoon instead of a fork and knife. And they were scared that if they moved us here, people would hurt us for all the same reasons. So, I learned how they talk, how they act, how they think here. And I promised mom and dad that one day, when we move here, I would teach you. 
so that no one had any reason to hurt you. And now we're here. And I don't have anyone to talk to. Worst of all, I don't know how to talk to you or mom or dad. You're enough, Joseph. That's all you need to know. Sapat na tayo. What does that mean? Don't worry. We'll learn. <laughs>